But before then, I have to endure and leave you. Just so one day it will come true, my dear sister. All checkpoints have been informed. I dispatched 20 pawns to follow them. But I haven't heard from the Lord. Still, there's no news? Have you found her yet? No. And in Chu's mansion, nothing has happened. Cho Jinglong is volatile. If he finds out Chong Ru Yi is Wang Ru Ling and Yan Zhe concealed it, he will be angry and go berserk. Perhaps he doesn't have your sister. Or maybe even if she is caught, she has said nothing about Ru Yi. You still won't talk? About what? Is Cheng Rui Ling Ling? And is Ling Ling actually Wang Ru Ling? I've told you many times. Cheng Rui is dead. Who is Ling Ling? You should ask Zhou Yanchi. Why ask me? Mm. Even now, you still lie to me. I already knew that. Prince Chen is right chancellor, your own brother. He has been so cruel to you. Why do you still lie for him? I don't know what you're talking about. Don't bother lying. I've been doing covert investigations and found many interesting secrets. After I seize Wang Ruling, you all should just face your lord's rampaging storms. Though we don't see eye to eye, I am a Qi descendant. How can I be a eunuch stooge? No one can hurt Chang Rui. Except me. Majesty, Prince Chun has arrived. Majesty. I should have died earlier. Every day is a blessing for me. Uncle. Don't be too upset. I summoned you today to talk about the matter last time. I hope you could agree. I have to refuse it. <sighs> Qiu Ziliang wants to use Yan Zhi as the queen, but I will sacrifice myself to pave the way for you. What do you want to do? My wedding day. Everyone will toast me. Me, Xiu Ziliang, and Xiu Yanzhi. We will all get poisoned wine. 
No. Xiu Ziliang is paranoid. If we drink together, in front of the people, he won't suspect. You can't, Uncle. I'll die along with Xiu Ziliang. After that, you bring out the edict. <laughs> Lefrook's duty day either. Who are you? Your left rook. Take her down. Go now. Who are you? Cut the crop. Just go. Here.
step one through Gao Ping's mouth. I'll leak the news that I'm dying to Qiu Ziliang in seclusion. No wonder you keep Gao Ping around. Step two. My secret pawn will insinuate Qiu Ziliang. That after I die, what will happen if Prince Shen betrays him? Qiu Ziliang will force the entry to marry you. Once she becomes the Empress, his position will be solid. So, Qiu Ziliang will soon force me to marry Qiu Yanzhi. As a result. As a result, the third person, aka Prince Chen's plot, will be ruined. If he wants to take the throne, he will stop Yan Zhi from marrying you. Yeah. Or maybe he'll work with Qiu Yanzhi. And to get rid of Qiu Ziliang. Kill two birds with one stone. Everything that happened is all up for the fur. Soon I'll be biting the dust. This lasting battle. I can finally break away from it. Then it'll be a battle with Prince Chen and Qiu Ziliang. Thus. At a time like this, you see clearly what he actually wants. Majesty, I have a question to ask you. In this elaborate plot, where do I fit? Yeah. Rui, leave Han for now. Distract some of their attentions for me. You will face danger along the way. But then, you will also have clarity on many things, such as such as what Qiu Yanzhi really yeah. wants. Left rook isn't there either. He must have found something and went for Lingning. <laughs> Zhu Qi, didn't I send you to protect Ling Ling? Left Rook attack. He had a peace token. I knew it. This token is only held by the peace holder. Why would Lord give it to him? Seems not just Ling Ling, but my cover is blown too. But generally, if the Lord knows it, he wouldn't just send thirteen people with Left Rook. So I guess he didn't tell everything to the Lord. Why? Lack of evidence. Yan Xiao, you go safely. Ling Ling. I'll check up with Jules now. Okay. Someone. Peaceholder, what happened? How's my father? He's still in seclusion. Father, how are you? I've missed you. Hmm. <sighs> Sorry to interrupt. Please forgive me. Do you know now? You should get out. Yes. Watch closely, especially on left rook. Yes. yes. Really, please be safe and sound.
Ja! Left Rook. Oh, what brings you here? Why did you leave without permission? I was just doing my job, but you and Peaceholder have done many things you should not have. <laughs> Nonsense. Just surrender. <sighs> Greetings, Peaceholder. There once was a peace battle. All the pieces were dead. Except you were left alive. Turns out, you do remember me. I didn't expect. Blink of an eye, you've ascended to the left rook. And you are trying to replace me. Tell me. What do you know? What did you grasp? What you tell our lore? Are you scared? Well, that's what I should ask you now. <laughs> I'm not scared. Because if I die, the Lord will know everything. Wang Ruling's secret, Prince Chen's secret, as well as your secret. Oh? That means he doesn't know these yet. Take a guess. What do you want? I told you. Just take a guess. <laughs> anyway, I'm in. No rush. Where's Ling Ling? Take a guess. If you dare lay a finger on her, I'll torture you to death. What a sisterhood. So sweet. I'll ask you one last time. What do you want? Back when you framed Red Knight, forced him to commit suicide, how did that make you feel? I'm Red Knight's brother, just like Wang Ruling is your sister. Wang Ruqing? It's too late, Wang Ruqing. If you haven't arrested me, we couldn't be sure. The way Lord admires you and trusts you, you might lie your way out. But now, <laughs> you screwed up. Checkmate. Asho. Yes. Do me a favor. What? Find Rolling and protect her. I need to talk to father.
<laughs> that was a very nice game. Yanja, let's go another round. Oh no? I should invite Right Chancellor over, team up with you, to play around with me. Guard? Yes. Invite Right Chancellor over. Yes. Good daughter. Sit. Hmm? Hmm. You're good. You're really good. When you were a kid, you suffered. You aspired, just so you can come close to me. You've gained my love, my trust, and even considered having you be the heir. You're a genius. <laughs> How could that pompous and vulgar Wang Yang have such a talented and thoughtful granddaughter? No. Not just one. But a pair. Chung Ru Yi or Wang Ru Ling is Wang Ru Ching's sister. Hmm. She has a totally different personality. She's strong, candid. She's sparkling like you. Hmm. You're both alive. I'm truly happy. This is the best thing ever since my seclusion. You shed a light on me. What is light? Light is hope. Light is wisdom. Understand? I am backing for a quick death. Hmm. <laughs> I understand. To father, death is mercy. I don't deserve that. Ruo Ching, you know me very well. You can ask me for anything. I only wish. For Rowling's death. Oh. Ah. Here comes the right Chancellor. No? I should say Prince Chen? You've just heard her. She wants her sister's death. What do you think? Also wish for her death? Hmm. <laughs> so what you two are saying? Is whatever I ask you to do, you will do it for me. Hmm? Yes. yes.
<laughs> Good for you two. Both of you. The so-called Mr. Thirteen held a secret book and tried to sabotage me. And the so-called goddaughter of mine tries to revenge. I was under the impression that I have tested you well. But look at you. Both of you. I have to let you know what I'm capable of. Yenger! Well, well, Yenger. In less than 15 minutes, the rope will burn and break, and the boiled oil will be poured down. You'd better think about it. Life and death are like chess games. There's still wiggle room. At this point, you'd better have Chi Yan's baby quickly. He's kicking the bucket anyway. Your son is your only hope. Yanja, you should know.
You want to marry Chi An, and I support you. You want Chi's kingdom, and I'll help your son be the emperor. I've done everything I could. Haven't I? As for Prince Chen, you've been right chancellor for many years. Then you can keep your position and help her son to be the emperor in the future. This is not a bad job. Anyway, you're all smart, and I only work with smart people. Because I don't need to care about their dignities. Smart people only care about their growth. Instead of going out of their way to prove them right. So now I will give you one more chance. Wang Ruqing, Wang Ruling, Qi An, and Qi Chen. The four of you have manipulated me. If I don't pay back harder, what kind of the greatest man am I? I'll let you all live and suffer. Slowly torture you until death. Your Majesty. Good. Here, take a sip. Pardon me. Here, take another sip. You are dismissed. Chien, I came to see you. How are you? On my way out. Nothing seems to matter. You are regretting. But it's too late. Chien, I just want to tell you at any time, you and I were on the same boat. It's just that we had a divergence, so we grew apart, which gave others advantages. <laughs> we're united for benefits. And we separate to gain more. <sighs> then 
That's right. That's why tutelage should start at a young age. What do you want? <sighs> Never mind that. Have some rest. I'm just going to put on a show. That agony cannot have me to bear it on my own. Right. Father. We all deserve this. But please. Throw you out of it. You think that it's still possible? Oh, my fault. Leave her out of it, please. Let me think about it. Father. 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 Father... <coughs> Father, I'm begging you. It's all my fault. <coughs> Majesty. <coughs> Your Majesty! <laughs> Your Majesty, don't be like this! <laughs> Don't be like this, Your Majesty. Uh. <laughs> Your Majesty. <laughs> Approaching. <gasps> Last time with Hanyu, I was very close to killing Chu Ziliang. I could have put him to death. But I lost. General Han sacrificed his life in vain. And Chiu Ziliang is still alive. I 
I should have known that he's a monster.就。